الاندير برزنتيشن معموله طبعا الجروب كله هو بتاع العمل الاي سي ان اس اي سي جي تكنولوجي فهنتكلم بس على الترمينولوجي بتاع الاي سي جي بس يعني this is again is informal فلو اي حد كنت عنده اي اسئله ممكن تساعدني كمان حضرتك لو حد انترست ممكن بتدخل على اللينك ده تمتحن وبيبقى بتاخد شهاده انك 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 عندك دلوقتي شهاده انك سيرتيفايد في الاي سي ان اس اي سي تكنولوجي وهم بيشتركوا بعد كده لو حد عايز يكولابريت مع اي حد من الناس دي في اي ستادي انه يكون عامل التست ده لان احنا ان هو نكون عارفين ان كله بيتكلم وان لانجويج فا ال ال A C N S I C B G terminology includes they talk about backgrounds, quality of life from discharges. I'm going to talk about the first one here, background. The first thing we're going to talk about is symmetry. So when you mark the background, it's either symmetric, mild asymmetry, or marked asymmetry. Mild asymmetry, there is consistent asymmetry in voltage or an appropriate preferential point less than less than fifty percent in amplitude. Out of frequency, that's 0.51 hertz. Out of 0.5 hertz, it's not asymmetric. 0.51 hertz, out in a consistent asymmetry, out of consistent asymmetry. After the consistent asymmetry, I'm marked asymmetry on more than one hertz frequency. But I will have to know background symmetric or asymmetric. And I think that predominant background frequency is alpha, theta, delta, or beta. We have to keep a strong dominant rhythm on that. PGR present or not. Give you more examples. And here about continuity. Hell is the background continuous, nearly continuous, and the occasional periods of attenuation slash suppression. But periods D only constituting one to nine percent of the record, or is it discontinuous? Low ten to forty-nine percent discontinuity in the record. Up to me, kira dekhanda ba kiti a burst attenuation slash burst suppression time. Like an up to me, this out ten to me the halas suppressed background. I need to be really important because that's why I need the homework part of the rest and that important for prognostication. But that you already can. That can go. That continuous EEG, nearly continuous, discontinuous, first attenuation slash suppression. Suppression. But here we have a little bit of suppression percent. I'm just going to out. This is still clearly asymmetric. I mean, if I did the eye scan, the EEG, and I saw the image, the first thing I saw was that the eye needs symmetry, right? Because you see that profound asymmetry like this. Clearly, the right side the impairment is really attenuated. مستخدم ده كمان ساعات في عالات مثلا ال subarachnoid hemorrhage for detection of vasospasm. إن دي ممكن ال EEG actually in all studies that looked at this beats TCD. إن TCD is more common use because EEG actually precedes this. فلو عين عارف إن continuous EEG will see EEG changes precede TCD changes. This is again you can see mild asymmetry. This is in the left. Let me check in here. This is burst suppression, especially or burst attenuation. Actually, in between, it's not completely attenuated. But it's a more burst attenuation that is suppressed. That is completely suppressed. Attenuation. Burst suppression. Burst suppression. If I have some highly evolved form bursts, do I tell you I have an eye already? على مثلا دورنيكم بامب وانا شفت المنظر ده اشك ان العين ده هايلي لايكلي اول ما اسحب السيديشن العين ده غالبا هيدخل في سيريوس لان دي تو سايدز هاف لوكت ات ذيس اند دي شون ذات ذيس كود بي ا بريدكتور فور هاي سيريوس هاو دو ذي ديفاين هاي ليفت فروم بيرس يو سي تو اور مور ابات فروم ديسشارجز ويزن ذا ماجورتي اوف بيرس اكثر من 50% في بيرس في المنظر ده تخاف ان العين ده اول ما هتسحب السيديشن العين هيدخل في سيريوس زي مثلا المنظر ده بيرس سبريشن ويز هايلي ليفت Identical bursts. Give a note. We study them after for cardiac arrest. A study from the Hollandian group of Michel van Kooten. In this group, they looked at this and they found that actually, if you see burst suppression with identical burst, almost always that prognosis for cardiac arrest. Yeah, you show full burst, they bought for that. And how what? Let me show variability, intact variability. The indication in the intact brain function. I want to show you that no, full identical. It's actually bad for us. This is a study from Hofmann, Jair, Michel van Putin, the Roma, the Dutch group that looked at this and found it. So you're associated with Nashu. Naps, and the coffee naps at first. So, these are the African Aaron Putin and the Aaron. Background reactivity. When we talk about reactivity, in the Roma, it's a mafrut. 
بيجربوا يعني مثلا النير المفروض الطبيعي التكنيشن بيدخل على عيان بيحاول ان هو يعمل اكتيفيشن الاول بالصوت العيان ما استجابش فبيعملوا مثلا فينشنج او حاجات زي كده ناقش ستيمولاي عشان بيشوفوا العيان هيرسبوند مش بس بتشوف العيان هيرسبوند او لا لكن كمان بتشوف الاي اي جي ريسبونس اي اي جي ريسبونس لو بيشوف مثلا هل هنا حصل رياكتيفيتي ولا لا شفت شويه فاست اكتيفيتي ما كانتش موجوده في البدايه فده تشينج ده از اكشلي رياكت واضح صح؟ يعني بص هنا فاست اكتيفيتي الظاهر دي ما كانتش موجوده فده اسمه اي اي جي رياكتيفيتي لان ذوز ار جود بروجنوستيك ساينس Uh, بعد كده بقى نتكلم عن state changes هل في state changes ولا لا؟ Do you see um, هل هل يعني هل في بيحصل awake sleep cycle transition ولا لا؟ لأن دي برضه good prognostic sign. في حاجة اسمها sick this is an abnormal state change بس أحسن من إن هو يبقى invariable حاجة اسمها cyclic alternating pattern of encephalopathy decay. Uh, إن أنت إن هو العيان بيفلكتويت ما بين Uh, high amplitude delta and then theta uh, activity. It shows us that I need to see Breach, طبعا ده لما يكون عيان عنده زي ما احنا شايفين كده high amplitude the hepta. This indicates that there is a breach there. That's very sad. Higher amplitude لان انت العيان ده اللي عنده strong defect في الهبتا دي. مش بس high amplitude you could see faster activity. Sporadic epileptiform discharges, not being cut in spike. Sharp wave spike is less than 70 millisecond. 70 to 200 is a sharp wave. Poly spikes, no octal spike. There's a sharp pre-contoured waveform. When we talk about phases, we have to talk about one plus number of baseline crossings. And that's what we have to do with EMG. Discharge versus burst. The discharge, I'm hoping you can best assume the discharge, like, you know, like more than one, will last in more than 0.5 seconds, they call it a burst. After that, when we talk about them, even in the reports of them, on the discharges, when they say frequent, it's supposed to be a common, not a common language, meaning it's frequent. I don't know if it's a frequent, or if it's a frequent, or if it's a very frequent. The most frequent, I never shoot. The most abundant, I never shoot for after one per ten second. I mean every single page, basically. And usually the one page is ten second page. More than one minute, but less than one per ten second is called frequent. More than one per hour, up to one per minute is occasional. Less than one per hour is rare. Hello, what now? I said, I shoot in spot. I shoot fourteen EEG. I shoot more than one spike. It's not rare. I mean, so it's not less than one per hour. It has to be occasional. 